Hello, my name is Tim Kroll. I am a customer success engineer at ZV. Today, I would like to explain how we can create an all day event on Google Calendar using Zenfi. So it's going to take three actions to accomplish this. Currently, Zenfi does not have a single action to create the all day event. An all day event in Google Calendar, when you're creating an event, you'll see that there's a little checkbox here that says all day. When you check that box, if you didn't know, it creates an event that looks like this top one here. So this test event, you'll see it doesn't have a time and it, does, and it appears at the top of the calendar. Whereas a second one has a time and it's gonna appear on your calendar wherever that time slot is. So if it was from four to seven, it would stretch out from four until seven. The all day events will stay at the top of the screen. These are useful if you're having multiple calendars for multiple vendors or multiple employees. You can make each calendar a different color and they would appear at the top of your Google Calendar for easy management. Let's look at these three um, actions that we need to put together. So the first action is a, a format date and time action and I have it prefaced by G, G Cal, and I, this is just a personal preference. So I have all three of these um, with the same prefix so that I know that they are grouped together. Format date time, if you go into the configuration, um, you can either select a date manually or you can choose a token from a different, act, uh, different uh, action or trigger from earlier on in your flow. And then you wanna make the format this format right you can just copy paste from down here, paste it up here. So that is the first action. The second action is an add date time action. That one, you take the result from your first action. And if it's a, for one day, you would put the one there. If it's obviously more, you'd put uh, over what, however many days it is with the same format for the dates. Google Calendar event is the third action. So you want to put in your uh, Make sure your connections are called out. Um, make sure uh, you have a subject. Description is optional. Location is optional. Busy or free is kind of important. If you want to uh, block off the calendar for the entire day, then you will select busy. Otherwise, if it's just there for a placeholder and or reminder, you would select free. You can add attendees if you'd like. And this one is really important. So again, I want to park here just for a quick second. So on the time zone, we're going to go back over to here and we look at the time zone. It's very important that your time zone and your Google Calendar settings and the Zemfy um, event action configuration, you need to make sure that they match. So you want to make sure that this time zone matches this time zone. If it doesn't, then you're going to end up with some weird calendar appointments. Okay, so if you, they don't match, you're going to have one that looks like similar to this, and it's going to have the, the you know it's going to appear on the calendar wherever the the time zone is on your Google Calendar. When they match, when you match them up, then you're going to get the correct uh, format for your calendar event. So that's how you create an all-day event in Google Calendar using the Zenfi solution. Thank you very much. Have an excellent day.